absolute dog shit. What the fuck is this place? Hey, where are you? Right here. In the bathroom. Oh, you're in the bathroom? Yeah. I'll be out soon. Oh, fuck. Sorry. Oh. You're fine. Jesus. You okay in there? Yeah, I'm alright. I'm alright. What happened? You really want to know? I mean, I've heard that you were arrested in Mexico with no identification at all. I don't know, they're trying to charge you with resisting arrest and stuff, so... I don't know what to do. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, and you're like, mem or you're like, agency shit's been terminated because of what happened. Oh, I gotcha. Do you want to come out now? Yeah, I'll be out. Hold up. Okay, we'll be waiting, we'll be waiting. I do. What's it been like in here? Rag. Also, your um, girlfriend's here. Natasha? No, bring her up. Okay. Alright. Natasha, come down here. Natasha. Yeah. It's good to see you. Good to see you Alright. This is no. not the worst looking prison. It's kind of modern in here. Oh, yeah, it is. Like a looking bed. Yeah, pretty much. How you been? Why? Yeah, I know. Should be coming out soon, I hope. The way your partner is way out of the situation. Um, that might work. That might work. I just want to come home. My daughter misses me. Oh my gosh. Well, I guess she knew. She knows something's up then. Poor kid. Hopefully sooner. Oh, don't worry about me. I'll be all right. I'm safe I, and all that. I remember Camilla used to go see you and everything. Oh yeah, speaking about that, emergency in this prison is on the other side. Like an identical cell. Oh, I know, because we're trying to keep him safe because of his popularity. Well, I'm not trying to keep him safe. I mean, they're trying to keep him safe because every other man is to kill him and kill an agent. Oh, well, that would explain it. Is there? I mean, 
if you want to come... I'm sorry. Natasha, do you want to come... Yeah, they look alike, I know. That's why I get confused. She reminds me of Camille a lot. Natasha, do you want to come speak to Meridos? He's in the other side of the prison. Um, I think not. I don't have nothing to say to him. I could it my sister. But he didn't kill your sister. I know, but how he, the way he treated her, he smacked her a couple of times, I just don't like how the way he treated her. And, oh. That would explain, explain it. it. But well, is there um, to bail him out, though? I can't bail him out, but we're trying to get his identifications and all that stuff figured out right now. Because he has zero, I think. So you, you can't just come home? Oh, no, at least you're on house arrest? It's, it's impossible right now because he has no identification at all, so you can't do anything. We're trying to get everything oh. scrambled up, so we can When you do his identification for so can y'all like Yeah, we them? can try. With, yeah, we should be able to bail them out if we have identification for them. Sounds good. Well, it's past your bedtime right now in the prison, so... Yeah, I know. My daughter misses him a lot, so... I can't wait to see her. Yeah, my daughter's on the way. Alright. We're going to go and get some sleep, so... You take care of yourself. I will. Don't get I love you. Okay. Is there a way I can keep in contact with him? Like call him sometimes? Um, we could try to sort that out. For example, I don't know. I don't have any authority over here in Mexico, so. Yeah. Maybe we should be good. Yep. Take care of yourself. Give me the, give me the, uh, the daughter hug. I love you too. Bye. Bye, hon. You alright, bro? Yeah, I'm alright. It's just that I just really want to get out of here. Yeah, I know. It's fucking disgusting here in Mexico. It is. I see right now. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you know, you gotta deal with the whole entire people and stuff. I don't see how musicians handle it. Here in the he's not a musician anymore. He's retired. Who? And since he retired, he's kind of lost popularity really bad. Well, Marcus? He seems a bit he seems a bit insane right now. Like he's a bit crazy at the moment. Really trying to fight with guards and stuff. Like, he's lost his mind a bit. So, wow. Yeah. He's not like the guy he used to. You know? He's completely gone. I wonder. Oh shit. Otherwise, the security guard is going to grab you, literally, and pull you out the door and kick you out, and then you won't be He's able to see to him or talk to him. So you should come with me, or you'll get banned from coming here, so do some other need to come. Yeah. I don't want to cry. Just don't cry. Please don't. Yeah, come on, Natasha, let's sit up seriously. Come on. We gotta sign out. Bye, go.
the new car. Yep. Damn, she looks nice. Look Thank you, I love it. It's perfect. Well, anyway, thanks for Pretty the, um, thanks for the help. Well, in time. Alright, have a nice day. Later. Yes, my name is Brandon McCain Gonzo. I'm supposed to be here um, trying to like reopen my account. I heard it was seized. Have you got a reservation? Yes. Um, Do you know who you're here to see? I'm supposed to see Mr. Uh, Mr. Mendez. Uh, supposed to be like the bank manager, branch manager. Thank you. I just got a new car today. But just about a couple of days ago, I just came out of prison and I had some savings saved. Okay. Okay. How long were you serving? About, well, two years the most. Two and a half years. But. How much did you serve? Oh, how long was my sentence was? It was about. It was supposed to be ten years, but I got. Uh, I got parole, pretty much. They cleared all charges and stuff. Good. Yep. Okay, what can I do for you? I'm here to unseize my account because I heard it was seized. 
um, by the time I got okay. arrested. Okay, okay, okay. Let me just check it out here quick. Ah, yes, your account's been frozen. Oh, that looks pointed. So, right now, all of your um, equities and funds, so nothing has happened or anything has happened during your money during your sentence. Okay. Okay. But all of your car at auction to pay for the crypto fees. Okay. So I could unfreeze that, but that would take maybe a week for a process. That's fine. Okay. Anything else you need? Well, I mean, is there a way I can get, like, maybe... At least one grand out of the account, like I can just do it, uh, a withdrawal. So you want to, you have to get a loan first. A loan? Uh, how much is a loan exactly? A thousand dollars plus interest. Interest? Um, about 35 percent. Oh, 35 percent? Okay, um, yeah, I'll do that, I'll do that. Count back. I heard you're one of those like FBI guys. Yeah, undercover. One of those, uh, just an undercover special agent, you can say. Uh, you must know, um, that, what was his name? He, he works for IAA. Oh, Mr. Oh, agent Jason? He's an asshole. What happened that was since I was gone, if I may ask? Nothing. Hmm. Well, Those I don't guys know. killing each other. Like, likewise. <laughs> yeah. Caesar's rich again. Still alive, huh? Mm-hmm. Jesus. He's... He's, um, he's the president of Mexico now. Are you serious? Hmm. He's done pretty well for himself. He's helped get people help. Like, he's cut down on drugs. Like, he put a slip down at saving people. He's a hero over there. Is he following the terrorists for, uh, the border and stuff? Terrorist, you the fucking hero, man. You no, I'm talking about no, no, no. I'm talking about, about the terrorists. No, the terrorists, not terrorist. You know the uh, trading agreements and stuff. You know. Oh, I don't know. Let's hope it keeps going. I'm gonna check the internet, man. I will. Already. <clears throat> well, anyway, um, so it's gonna take about about a week to actually everything processes, then I can have my account yeah, back. Yeah, then you then you gotta pay back your money, bro. All right, that's fine. Already. Well, thank you very much for your visit for allowing me to business with you. America, thanks you, man. Thank you. Have a nice day. Hey man, you got like some smoke? Some smoke? Um, cigarettes? No, like, no man. Like, smoke. Oh, that kind of smoke. Yeah, man. I got a joint. How big, man? Is it fat? Yeah. Um, medium size, but it's kind of like a burrito kind of looking. Did you say a burrito? Kind of. Why the fuck would I want to... Man? No, the joint is big as a burrito. Ah. Uh, oh, so 
like some Cheech and Chong. Yeah. Yo, man, you should come up to my uh, Sandy, man. We can like get real high. Man. Well, this is today's your lucky day. Here you go. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. You're a lifesaver, man. All right. This is ten, this is five dollars. That's it. You don't have to pay more than that. Oh uh, man, you're good, man. Let me that up, man. Oh man, that's good shit, man. Oh yeah. yeah, man. You like my car? It's that's my. It's, oh, that's my car. That's my van. Over there, man. This one here. Over there. Oh, yeah, that Volkswagen. Man. Yeah, man, the combi, man. Oh, nice. Yeah, man. Why if we were right for a little bit? Sure, man. I know where we're gonna go. All right. Yo, man, let's go get food. All right, I know a place. Um. Let's see. Man. There's a man, restaurant it, up ahead it, somewhere. It's just, is it, is it up in Adams? That's the best, man. Oh, hell yeah. The burgers are good. I think it's a chicken there, too. Uh, man, you make me hungry, man. I'm, I'm already hungry. It's pretty so, good. So, whoa, up Stoner Street, man. Uh -huh. What you doing in L.A.? You don't look like you're from here. Well, I, I just came out of the joint. I was a, um, I was a federal Yo. agent that was in Mexico actually trying to get some Oh shit, you're a cop, fuck, yeah. No, no worries, man, I'm the cool cop, man. Don't worry about it. Ah, cool cop. Oh, shit. I don't know what I want, man. Uh, let's see, they got the triple burger on it. Let's see, um, triple burger. Bacon triple cheese melt. Uh, yeah, shade. can I get whatever he's getting, but like double it? Yeah. Yeah, Alan, let me have the uh, bacon trip uh, two of the bacon triple cheese melt and two of the triple burgers, uh, a jumbo shake and French fries, and let me have a large stock of pepper, please. All right, that would be forty dollars and forty-five cents. Please turn it up when you're ready. Yeah, um, man, we're gonna be so fat, man. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> man, these windows, man, they're retarded. Yeah, I know. Yeah, let's get out food, man. Dark up and eat it, man. Alright. Those Hollywood damn, stars. Damn, look at all those. Damn, these like. Marilyn, Marilyn Monroe. Monroe Hot Mama. Charlie Chaplin. Oh, I love Charlie Chaplin. Is that, is that Elvis? No, that's. Um, I forget his name was. He's bad. Who's the cowboy? Is that Johnny Cash? Close enough, from what it looks like, yeah. Yeah, I don't know, man. I'm just gonna fuck with Yeah. Let me light another joint, man. I never got a yeah, chance to have man. your name. What's your name, man? What one? Your name. Ah. Uh, yeah. My name's Charlie. Charlie? Well, my name's Brandon, by the yeah. way. Pleasure hey, to meet you, man. Hey, Brandon. Nice to meet you, too, man. I live up in, like, up north a bit, man. Everyone smokes fucking, like, weed and everything here, man. If, if, if you didn't know, man, I'm a hippie. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that. Yeah, man. It's so, gang, man. So what you doing out here in LA? I don't know, man. I was coming up here for, like, some festival. But, like, man, we all got really high on these, like, fucking acid and shit. 
and then we all woke up in like the fucking these dumpsters and it was fucking rad man Huh, a crazy. festival? Was it a metal concert or something? No, I don't remember, man. I never got tagged. We woke up in a rubbish bin. Was it Revelations Arise? Yeah, it was one of the big bands, man. They're one of the heaviest, heaviest bands in the world. They were actually a little bit ahead of Metallica. Yeah, man. Yeah, Meredith is one of the best musicians I've heard. Drive. You want me to drive for you? No, nah, man, I can handle it. Alright. I haven't crashed yet, so that's good. Alright. I got a place around the corner on the other side of town. It is. Wait, where are you? Where'd you park, man? I can take you back to your car. Uh, go this way and make a left turn up ahead. And then just go oh, straight down right the street. Right. Yeah, yeah, right here. What's that place? Honte? That looks cool. Is it like a party place? From what it looks like, yeah, that's what I heard. Someone told me it's a club, you know, but the that one in, on the other side of town where the port is, they said that's the best club over there. Okay, man. Just straight down? Oh, uh, no, I took that's the right, that's right. Oh, you're fine, you're fine. Go down right here and then make a right right here. We're at that suburban store up there. Uh, I get... Uh, this place. Yep. Yeah, that's my car. I see your car, man. Yeah, me too. It's right there. Your door is open. Yeah, I know. I looked it up by accident. <laughs> You'd let you know I stole your car, man. That's brand new. Totally uh, new. Yeah, man, we should hang out again when you're in, like, L.A. Oh, I'm from L.A. I'm living in downtown. Ah. Well, well, man, I gotta head back, because I got these shrooms in, like, my bag, and I really want to eat them. I get really fucked up, man. Alright. Well, it's good seeing you, Charlie. Well, take care of yourself. Yeah, man. Oh, hold on. This is my address to the apartment downtown. Uh, uh, I'll I do remember it. Alright. See you, man. Alright, see you. Natasha? Yeah, who it is? It's actually Agent Brendan. Oh, it's you. Hmm. I'm out of jail. Yeah, and? Well, they knocked out two years. That's it. Hmm. Okay. That was a false, that was a false, uh, thing on there. I don't know if you saw on the news or not. No. I didn't watch the news because I was busy working, taking care of my child. Um, are you busy right now? Huh? Are you busy right now? No. Is it alright if I come over and talk to you? Sure. Sure. Alright, I don't know where your address is. Uh, uh, 3418, um, Mendoza Street. Mendoza Street? Alright, copy that. 9118 Mendoza Street. I'll see you in a bit. <clears throat> Alright. Mm -hmm. 
That was up her nose. You just have to drive in there. Way to go, Agent. I guess this might be the house, I'm not sure. <clears throat> so it's 91, 18, Mendoza, whatever. Anybody's home. Oh, she's right here. What? Oh, what shit. Hey. Look, uh. Hi. Okay, why are you acting like that? Oh, let's see. Because I actually take care of my child and you have it and you got your ass locked up. So, yeah, that's fine. Just have a good day. What? Uh, you do realize I got arrested for actually entering the New Mexico yeah, illegally. Yeah, you got your own self locked up. For no reason. And I asked you to take care of my child like every three times. And you didn't like give me an answer, so I don't know what to tell you. I have nothing else to say to you. Are you even high or something? Because you know the reason why I really went to jail? It's not because of that. When I picked you up the last, last time, I picked you up to the hospital last time, you got locked up. Yeah, because I actually was doing undercover work there. That is why I was doing my job. I wanted to find the person that you murdered your, your sister. Child. Okay, but you didn't think about your own child? And you didn't think about your own child. Uh, excuse me, it ain't my child. You just told me from the beginning it was your child. So how is it my child? She it's not blood. She's, she's your child too. If I'm your girlfriend, she's your child too. So you're telling me, hold on, hold on, let me get this straight. From what you're telling me, she's actually my what, my stepdaughter? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Yeah, she's your stepdaughter too. If I'm your girlfriend, she's your stepdaughter. Yes. Why did Because I was supposed to go to California. No, I was supposed to go to San Francisco for a meeting and I had to cancel my trip because she wasn't here to watch her. I was in jail at the time, so how am I supposed to get out? You thought I was going to get out right away? <clears throat> I had to find a babysitter. I had to ask one of my friends to babysit my child for me while I was away. You couldn't ask Angelica? I don't want to talk to Angelica. She's a drug addict. Oh, now she's a druggie? You know, why do you think I told you she does drugs and stuff? Well, that would explain it. <clears throat> I don't trust Angelica watching my child. I don't trust her. Where's the kid anyway? Where is she? Is she okay? Who? Your daughter. I don't know her name is. Yeah, she's fine. She's sleeping. Okay, that's all she's that matters. Sassy. 
Well, I already found who actually murdered your sister for real, and I'm gonna bring that guy to justice if I have to. It's not over yet, it's just the beginning. Look, like I said, your sister and I were together for a long time, including Agent Hyman himself. Trying to pull a case together, but he didn't do the dangerous missions. I'm the one that had to pull myself through it. To try to actually apprehend Caesar and Angelica as well. I don't know what she's doing, but she's not being wanted now. Because she's going along with that Caesar guy. So. No, it's not just that. <clears throat> and as I said, I know what she's doing. She's helping him with drugs and stuff. So, I didn't know what she's doing. That's where I need your help with that. I know. I'm not getting into this. I have a child to take uh, care I'm not, I'm not talking about going to her house and whatever. I'm not talking about that. You need my help, but I need to stay with my child. So I think it's the best. No, thing. actually, I'll help take care of her. You said that before and you didn't do it. So. Well, I'm here now. Well, I was in jail at the time. What's the matter with you? Hey! I'm not talking about this. Natasha, hold up. I heard that. Hey, you know, I heard that. My, you know my baby daddy is on child support. You know he has not given me any money. I don't know how much child. he owes you. That's what I need to find out because it's not giving I me on the he list. He owes a thousand a month for her. Well, how behind is he? How much is he behind? It's actually five thousand. He owes me. Everything, child support, everything, for her and stuff. He has not paid me the money yet, and I'm still waiting for him to pay me the money, but he's just refused to pay to pay me. Shh. Come with me. Come on, so, come with me. Why? I'm not leaving my child here by myself. I'm not, no, that's not what I'm going to do. I'm going to show you something. Where Look, it's going? just it's I'm just not, a surprise I want to give you, okay? Just just uh, just don't argue about it, okay? Yeah, but I'm not leaving my child here right now, so. I ain't taking you out anywhere. What is the matter with you? It's it's really late at night. Here. Oh. <clears throat> the heck is that? Went to my bank yesterday. Here's seven thousand to cover everything. <laughs> it's yours. Yeah, that's yeah, fine. I, if you want me to come with you guys, I, I will. Say, but you lie, I have forty so. bucks with me. Hey. My dad gave me it. Your your ex husband is actually what behind the payments. Well, that should cover for about a couple of months after that. Thank you. I, I don't know what to say. This really means a lot. No, no. Like no, 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 no. Don't Thank be. You. No, no. You're very welcome. You know I love you. You know I care about you. You know I'm going to do anything I can. Well, i got to get going anyway, so... Let me no, get my stuff packed and I'll start bringing it over, okay? Just stay right here. Stay. Okay, I'll stay. Yeah, how about I come with you so I can help you with the stuff? Alright, that'll work. Agent Hyman, Agent. go ahead and pull the, the car into the driveway, please. No, you can do it. Go ahead. He can stay here and watch my child. I'm trying to help you. It's That's fine. Okay with him. I don't know if that's okay with him. Well, he's watched the uh, casino's kids and. pretty much his oldest daughter, uh, Emily. From his previous marriage that he had. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and get my car. Alright. How can you actually afford a house like this, if I may ask? Well, you know, I work every day, 24 7 a week, so I can afford a house like this. Hmm. <laughs> 
What a nice car, by the way. Hey, you're welcome. Well, I need somebody to move that car. I want the driver. I'll take care of it. Just go straight out of here and make a left turn and go like directly uh, to the hills uh, on. Agent, can you stay there and watch my daughter, please? You park the car right in the driveway, it's fine. That's up to you. Mm -hmm. 